Hi everyone, my name is Emily Martin and I'm a graduate associate with Prevention and Wellness. And today for Wellness Wednesday, we're gonna be talking about spiritual wellness and spending time in nature. So here's our wellness wheel. You can see on the left-hand side in pink, it's the lighter pink, we have the spiritual wellness dimension of wellness. So how does spiritual wellness and spending in time, spending time reflecting, um, relate. So spiritual wellness is defined as expanding a sense of purpose and meaning in life, including one's morals and ethics. And spending time to reflect really helps us find meaning in life, which is the essence of developing spiritual wellness. So here are some tips and tricks on spending time reflecting. So select a reflection process that works for you. So there are many different ways that you can spend time reflecting. You can spend time journaling, meditating. You can spend time listening to music and thinking about life. If it is a song that you might not be singing to in your head, because sometimes that can distract you. But those are all different ways that you can spend time reflecting. And some of those ways not might not work for others as they work for you. So for example, I probably couldn't spend time reflecting with listening to music or probably not even meditating either. I'm very um, driven by like writing stuff. So I would say that I would either write in a journal or even possibly type some stuff up on my computer, like in the little word application. So identify target questions is another way that you can sp uh, work on spending time reflecting. So think about questions you would ask yourself about life. So why is this? How is this? What will I do to get where I want to be? That kind of thing. And those are all questions you could have written in your journal or just in your head when you're meditating or journaling or writing. And then schedule time. Scheduling time is a big thing that is um, kind of contributes to all different parts of all eight dimensions of wellness because when you don't schedule time in your daily life to actively work towards being well it is difficult to actually put forth that effort and do that so scheduling time is a really big deal and making sure that you are spending time to reflect to improve your spiritual wellness so here's some extra information i found this quote on lifehack.org and i'm going to read it to you i thought it was really awesome and pretty inspiring we keep moving we push through we don't stop to reflect reflect we stay in jobs that are literally killing us relationships that zap our energy circumstances that leave us stressed unhappy frustrated and tired we keep running on the treadmill of life thinking we don't have time to waste so we keep moving in order to keep up but too often we just crash and burn that's because the only way to keep up with the pace of life is to stop to hop off the treadmill to reflect on what's working and what's not to identify what to keep and what needs to change so by improving your spiritual wellness, it gives and reflect using that time to reflect, it gives you the opportunity to truly focus on what you're doing in life that works and what you're doing in life that may not be the best for you. And as well as things that you should keep people you should keep around and things that might need to change or people that you might need to kind of distance yourself from. And all of these things combined would help will help you really decrease your stress, become happier, and, and reduce your frustration in life. And those are all ways that your spiritual wellness and reflecting can help you do those.